Stuff your tomatoes like this. The result is amazing. Hit the like button already, then leave your comments on this recipe. Start by cutting three ripe tomatoes. Make four slits on each tomato, making sure you don't cut all the way through just like this. And set them aside. Now cut one half red onion. First chop it into thin strips, then into small dices. Once you've done that, grate 100 grams of mozzarella cheese and set aside. After that, grate three boiled eggs using the small holes in the grater, just like this. Next, into a skillet over medium-low heat, add one drizzle of olive oil. Then all the onion we've just chopped. And stir fry until slightly golden brown. This is the right cooking point. You may now turn off the heat. Once you've done that, into a medium bowl, add all the grated cheese. Also add two tablespoons of Brazilian cream cheese, the grated eggs, the onion, two crushed garlic cloves, one half teaspoon of salt, and mix all the ingredients very well until combined. Leave us a comment with the name of the city from which you're watching this. I'd like to give you a shout out and thank you for sharing this recipe. This is the right consistency. You may now stop mixing. Once you've done that, using a teaspoon, stuff the tomato slits with this mixture. Stuff them well and gently to make sure you don't rip the tomatoes. If you've made it here, that means you're enjoying our recipe. So click the share button and share this video with all your friends. It won't cost you anything, but for us, it will make all the difference. Finally, transfer the stuffed tomatoes to a baking dish. Take to a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius or 356 degrees Fahrenheit and let them bake for 10 minutes. Baking time may vary depending on the power of your oven, so keep an eye out. That recipe is ready. You may now take a serving and enjoy it. I really hope you like this recipe. Now I'll head back to the comment section and we'll continue to answer everyone who left the name of their city. And I'll also thank you for sharing this recipe. See you next recipe. Bye.